After Effects is one of the best software when it comes to visual effects, compositing, and motion graphics. That is for sure. But is it a headache to learn? In today's video, we will be answering that question. Let's jump right in. Let's get on with the short answer for this question. Yes, After Effects is not easy to learn, like at all. This is all due to the fact that the software is rich with an abundance of tools and features. After Effects can easily help you create the best motion graphics you can get, as well as make extremely realistic looking compositing and visual effects if you know how to play your cards right. And although not the software's greatest strengths, making frame-by-frame -frame animation is also a possibility within the software. When you have a software that can do all of these things combined, it is unrealistic to think that it's going to have few tools and by extension easy to learn. A great way to look at the structure of After Effects is to think of it as a combination of Photoshop, Illustrator, and Premiere Pro all in one software. How, you might ask? Well, it has Photoshop's countless visual effects and color manipulation options. It has Illustrator's ability of making 2D effects and assets, mainly used in aspects like kinetic typography and logo animation. And finally, it has Premiere Pro's ability to treat both image and video assets and seamlessly combine in them. Visual effects, compositing, and motion graphics are mainly used in filmmaking and social media video content, which means there is more need for video assets and After Effects does a phenomenal job in creating visual effects and compositing using video assets layered on top of another video. For instance, if you want to add a fire effect to your shot, that fire is going to have to move, especially if it's a windy day. When you have all of these tools and options at your disposal, it's only fair to expect that learning them for the first time can be very tricky, even if the software presents them in the most intuitive ways possible. One positive thing for sure is the fact that After Effects is the most commonly used software when it comes to creating visual effects, compositing, and motion graphics. It's quite the popular software and many people use it. For this very reason, it has countless tutorials made about it that come in the form of either YouTube videos, articles, paid and free courses, and workshops. When you have a software that is as powerful as After Effects, you will find some reliance from the industry on it, which generates wide communities that will for sure help you figure it out. It's very important to point out that After Effects is quite powerful and rich, but it also is not as hard as other software out there. For instance, while After Effects is the industry standard when creating motion graphics, it is surpassed in the visual effects and compositing side of things by other software such as Nuke, a node-based visual effects and compositing software. If you thought that After Effects was hard to learn, you're in for a ride with Nuke. Natron is also a software that is much harder to grasp than After Effects, except that it's free and open source. On the other side of the spectrum, you can find easy visual effects software such as HitFilm Express that are way easier to grasp and use than After Effects. But it's also important to know that they do limit you. So it's fair to say that After Effects meets you halfway. The software can be tricky to use and way harder than HitFilm Express, but a lot easier than Nuke. It's the middle ground and it limits you in no way. So, if After Effects meets you halfway, are you ready to do the same? We explore other facets of this subject in our video, Is After Effects Good for Beginners? So, make sure to check it out. If you're still unsure of whether to start your After Effects journey or not, it might help you expand your horizons a bit. The main takeaway we want you to keep in mind is that After Effects is indeed hard to learn, but it's actually worth it in the end. You cannot expect software to help you create wonderful things but be ridiculously easy to use. It doesn't work like that. After Effects is the perfect middle ground for ease of use and tools and features abundance. Well, this is it for our video. We hope you enjoyed it and learned something of value. Make sure to check out our series about After Effects for a deep dive into the software. Comment below if you think that we've missed something or if you have any other suggestions. Thank you for watching as always and see you next time.